We will talk about oral words. They are benign growth in our mouth and they are not painful but they cause discomfort. They are caused by human papillomavirus also known as HPV and this virus when infects our cells it causes stimulation or proliferation of cells. So these cells proliferate, proliferate and eventually they create this bump which is called papilloma or warts and here is question if this virus stimulates our cells to grow and proliferate it means it can cause cancer also right yes that's correct human papilloma virus can cause cancer that's why any warts are important but fortunately in the mouth most warts are caused by strain which is called HPV6 and HPV6 does not cause cancer so in most cases these warts are benign but sometimes it can be caused by HPV16 which is malignant subtype or strain so if person's word is caused by HPV16 here is chance for malignancy here is serious chance that this word will become cancer that's why we should watch it carefully any word in and any growth in our mouth and here's question that how big is this chance this chance is around one percent so in 99% of cases these words grow very slowly and usually will disappear within two years so prognosis generally is excellent but there is one percent chance that this word can be cancerous words usually are painless if they grow big enough they can cause some discomfort or itchiness sometimes they can interfere speaking or swallowing if they are too large and what are risk factors most important risk factor is multiple sexual partners because papillomavirus infection considered and especially oral papillomavirus is considered sexually transmitted disease and most common route of transmission is oral genital route but it does not mean that all cases of oral wars is caused by sexual uh, sexual transmission is not correct it can be transmitted direct contact for example a person can have word on hand and touch his or her mouth and transmission is possible uh, at, on this route but most commonly it's sexually transmitted also if person has compromised immune system risks are higher gold standard for diagnosis is biopsy and prognosis as we said is excellent but one person chance of malignancy and what is treatment treatment can be over-the-counter drugs which contain salicylic acid and small and solitary words can be treated with uh, salicylic acid uh, but they are not effective when there is multiple words podophilox is a topical medication which can kill word cells also imikimod stimulates immune system and it's also considered effective if these words are large enough or there is any risk of cancer surgery is recommended and surgery is indicated that's all i wanted to say thank you for your interest thank you for your watching if you like my, my videos please thumbs up if you like my channel please subscribe thank you very much bye for now